New tonight, we're learning how hospitals are dealing with a surge in flu and respiratory illnesses this season. Yeah, it's been pretty bad. The North Carolina Department of Health and Human Services reports six flu-related deaths this season, and one of those includes a child. CBS 17's Mariah Ellis is live, taking a look at how healthcare workers are trying to stay ahead of all of this. Mariah. Yeah, doctors say that your best defense against the flu is to get the vaccine. In fact, you could actually find your flu shot at pharmacies just like this one at CVS. Can you take big deep breaths for me? Dr. Kristen Donahue says appointments are filling quickly. In our clinic, at least in the last three to four weeks, we've definitely seen a lot of influenza, more than typical for this time of year. Donahue, a pediatrician at Cornerstone Pediatric and Adolescent Medicine, says they're seeing an early start to a possibly severe flu season. You've been coughing? I know, everyone's been coughing lately. Donahue says it comes as respiratory illnesses, including RSV, continue to rise in North Carolina, putting younger children at a higher risk. Are they pretty similar? They can be very similar. There is a lot of overlap, and it's keeping us very busy. Um, and I think that other clinics and uh, even the hospital systems are seeing that as well. Others are noticing. UNC Hospitals in Chapel Hill says flu cases more than doubled a week ago with 210 confirmed cases. They say RSV cases also increased with about two thirds of those cases impacting children. The strain and longer wait times have led providers to coordinate with other hospitals across the state. I think our biggest concern is just wanting to make sure that we have adequate access to care for our patients and our families. That's our number one priority. And with a lot of sick kids um, who need to be seen, that is leading to appointments filling quickly. Dr. Donahue says that the best way to prevent these illnesses from spreading is to make sure that you're washing your hands, stay home if you feel sick, and especially to get vaccinated if you are eligible. The CDC recommends that anyone who is six months and older to get their flu shot. In Raleigh, Mariah Ellis, CBS 17 News. All right, Mariah, thank you.